thanks guys for coming on out. Pretty exciting, uh, been a pretty exciting week for, for Bison Wrestling here. Um, and, and uh, you know, to, to, to start a day uh, like today with, with signing, uh, coming off of uh, a lot of fun uh, this past weekend for us. Uh, it's been a pretty pretty exciting week for, for our guys, our team, our squad, coaches, and, and our, uh, our upcoming uh, commitments. And uh, we're, we're fired up for the guys that we got coming in. I think, um, you know, the, the future's really bright with, with the group of guys we have, but more importantly, the, the guys that uh, have, have committed to, to joining the, the Bison Wrestling family in, in North Dakota State University are, are guys that are going to add a, a tremendous amount of value to our program, and, and we're really excited for that. Um, and, and with that, our, our, uh, I'd like to start off with our first commitment here uh, out of Lisbon, North Dakota, um, uh, Bowden Greenlee. He's um, he, a four-time state champ out of Lisbon. He is the face of North Dakota wrestling right now. Um, you know, I think he's, he's one of the, one of the best kids to, to come out of the state of North Dakota in a long, long time. And, uh, you know, I think it's important for us to, to keep a guy, uh, like Bowden Greenlee, uh, here in the state represent, uh, the state he, he's from, and he shares a lot of passion about that, his, uh, himself. And, um, you know, as we, we entered into the recruiting process with Bo Bowden, it was, it was exciting to see that, that he, uh, he put a, a ton of value in representing his home state of North Dakota as he, as he went on to his, his college athletics and, uh, it, you could tell it meant something. So that pride is something that we're really excited about. And, and I believe, uh, Bowden's going to do some really good things for us. Um, I, I would project, uh, Bowden to be a 57, 65 pounder in college and, and, um, you know, ultimately has, has some large shoes to fill, uh, as, as, uh, we're, we're coming to the end of a guy like Jared Franick. Um, the next guy I'd like to talk about, um, he's, uh, he's out of Glendale, uh, Arizona, upper weight, uh, uh, projected 197, uh, Markel Rivera Kane, wrestles for Ironside High School down in, in um, Arizona. Uh, another, again, uh, undefeated season last year, uh, out of Arizona. He's, he's a nationally ranked guy uh, at 195 pounds. He, we, we, we have a lot of uh, a lot of hopes for this young man. He's extremely athletic, has uh, a lot of ways to score in, in the game, and um, you know a guy that that we would we would anticipate is going to have an immediate splash uh, when he arrives in North Dakota State. So someone we're we're really excited about. Um, and then the third guy that uh, that that we have committed at this uh, at this time is uh, Carter Schmidt out of Belgrade, Montana. And um, this young man, uh, again, uh, state champion, coming off of a uh, an undefeated uh, season his junior year, looking at trying to 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 have uh, another another undefeated year. And uh, he's a young man that I would project to to come in at 133, uh, 141 projected guy. And uh, again, I, I believe he's going to come in. Uh, have an opportunity to to potentially redshirt and develop for us. But uh, again, a guy that we would anticipate having an immediate impact on our program and uh so we're really excited for um so these three guys uh right now are, are who we have committed to, to north dakota state we're expecting some more guys uh here shortly uh that that we're really excited about but uh these three guys are a great uh, great group to to help balance our program our roster and uh these all, all of these guys are, are going to be able to uh contribute uh immediately to the program and the successes that that uh that we're having in the direction that, that we're trending. So really excited about this group, excited to announce uh, hopefully some guys coming up here uh, at a different time, but um, really, really fired up for now, and, and I'll, I'll open up to any questions. Roger, what I know it was, it was so sudden to happen on Friday, but that kind of win, did that even impact this class just to firm up some guys between Friday and Wednesday? Yeah, uh, yeah, you know, uh, Friday going out and, and uh, knocking off a team like Nebraska, a top ten team in the country that's extremely talented, has a ton of a ton, ton of talent on the roster and well coached. Um, yeah, it was it was great. The amount of support that we got from our our, our commitments, the families that uh, are excited uh, to be a part of the program, they can see the direction that that the team is continuing to to head down. And uh, yeah, these these guys want to be a part of that. They they understood it throughout the recruiting process. They recognized that the team is is young and in good balance between a uh, experience and, and and young guys. And um, they can see the, the the health and wellness and the the direction of the team. So yeah, it's been exciting. Yeah, like Bowden Greenlee, you, know, you mentioned just a little bit ago, he is the face of uh, wrestling at the high school level in North Dakota right now. How huge is that to keep those kind of homegrown talents here? It's a big deal. I mean, our 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 goal is is to 
to you know put up a wall around North Dakota. We don't want we don't want our guys going anywhere. I mean, it's it's it means something to the the kids and it means something to our, our coaches. It means something to the the wrestling community here in North Dakota. So our our goal is and will be to 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 put a wall up around North Dakota. These are our guys. We we've watched them uh, grow up and and develop as as, as young men and, and, and athletes. And um, you know our, our goal is is to carry their their high school uh, tradition on into the collegiate area and. and and have uh, have open doors for for those guys.